Hello, today is Tuesday, which on Quiet as Mouse means that it's Reviews Day, and today I am reviewing a book, which is The Secret Diary of Lizzie Bennet, which I've just finished. The Secret Diary of Lizzie Bennet is based on the web series The Lizzie Bennet Diaries, which is based on Pride and Prejudice by Jane Austen. It's in the form of a diary, which is perhaps evident from the title, but I thought it was important to mention it, apparently. I can't imagine that a person who likes The Lizzie Bennet Diaries, the web series, wouldn't like this book. It's a very good tie-in, it's a very good extra. It stands on its own, but I think definitely it's better if you have seen the web series. Also, I found that the entries which I most enjoyed were the ones where I could vividly remember the episode that was being referred to. I think I would really enjoy reading this either at the same time as watching the Lizzie Bennet Diaries or immediately after watching the Lizzie Bennet Diaries. One of my favourite things about this book is that it adds stuff that you just can't get from the video blog format. For instance, I feel like I know Mr and Mrs Bennet far better now I've read this than I did from the um, Lizzie Bennet Diaries. Also, some of the events mentioned in the diaries are in more detail in this, for example, the Gibson wedding and Lizzie, Darcy and Gigi's trip around uh, San Francisco. Uh, Darcy's letter. Lots of important things that just wouldn't work in the video blog format, but which work perfectly well in a private journal. Obviously there's also stuff in the video blogs which aren't in this. I wouldn't say that you need to read it if you've watched and liked the Lizzie Bennet Diaries, but I would say that it is an excellent addition. I really enjoyed it, it's well written, I enjoyed reading it in Lizzie's voice. As a female YouTube content creator I found I related a lot to the Lizzie in this book. If we're doing the ratings thing, which I guess we are doing, then um, I gave the Lizzie Bennet Diaries 4.6 out of 5, so I guess I'll give this 4.4. And finally, I'm going to be trying to do book reviews every fortnight on this channel. And the next book I'm going to be reviewing is The Thirteenth Tale by Diane Setterfield. I really enjoyed the TV adaptation at Christmas, so I am very much looking forward to reading this. And that will be on the 29th of July. Also, in case by any chance anybody wants to read the books that I'm going to be reviewing, the one after that will be The Ocean at the End of the Lane by Neil Gaiman. And that will be on the 12th of August. Do let me know what you thought about the secret diary of Lizzie Bennett in the comments below and I'll see you tomorrow.